We turn our attention now to Adrian Sampson, who's limited work for sure, but he's been very impressive so far. It'll be Jaron Duran, who is back with the ball club. Swinging immediately as Duran launches one deep, backing up Crook. He's turning, turning, and she's gone right away. Home run, Jaron Duran. He leads off the game with a home run on the first pitch. Jaron Duran, welcome back. And the Red Sox take a one to nothing lead on the first pitch of the ball game. Right back at Sampson, stepping on the base. Simmons over to first for the double play. Okay, Rich is four and four, ERA a little over four. And he broke in with the Cubs way back in 2005. That's going to be in there for strike three. So Morrell will take a seat, and Rich gets his first victim today. Swing and a miss. He got him on a curve. Half the runner at second. Got him to go. He struck out three in the inning. Rich Hill on fire at the outset. Red Sox one Cubs nothing top of the second from Wrigley Trevor Story in the box here against Adrian Sampson and sharply bobbled by wisdom at third and he'll have an error on the first play of the second inning so the leadoff man is on in front of Franchi Cordero one two from Sampson and make it four in a row they had the shift on he hits that one into left field that'll put runners on at first and second Red Sox have come out hitting the ball hard here to give the fans. Inside going to walk him. So Christian's on. Vasquez will take his base and they're all loaded up with nobody out. Sampson's in big trouble. For the number nine hitter, Jackie Bradley, who steps in 0 for his last 26. He's hitless since June 19th. Swing. There's a shot hammer to deep right center field toward the gap. And it hits on the grass, rolls all the way into the ivy. Two runs have scored. Here comes Vasquez rounding third. The throw to the plate far too late. A three run bases loaded double by JBJ and the Red Sox lead it 4 0. What a way to break the 0 for 26. A little trickler here. Rich Hill trying to get to it. Flips on to get him. How about that at the age of 42 to make that play? Franchi doesn't know what to do because he knows if he goes for this ball, he might not get back to the bag in time. So he allows the young man, Rich Hill, to make an absolute amazing play. And then Franchi makes a great play with a bare hand. Look at those big mitts. <laughs> you can't even see the ball. His hands are so big. But good job by Franchi here, staying home to allow this play to happen, too. Oh, Bounce to third, love by Wisdom. Go to second. Morell's got it. Throws to first. Double play. Great arm by Morell, the middleman on the double play, and he needed a good strong arm to make that throw. That's a weapon for a second baseman to have. Two down. Velasquez 0 for 1. Velasquez first pitch swinging. Deep center. Back to the track goes Duran. Off the Ivy. And bounding back into center field. Higgins all the way around to score. Velasquez sliding in with the RBI triple. And the Cubs are on the board for the first time today. It's Boston four and the Cubs one here in the fifth. So now Morrell becomes the all important at bat here with one out where Sack Fly still gets the job done. Ground ball will get the job done then. He's showing a bump there, but he'll take a ball. And here comes Cora out with a trainer. To check on Rich. It's the last yeah, pitch. Some of his foot, I think. Yeah, he grimaces there right away. Seems to indicate he's all right. I mean, he's a typical 40-year-old. I mean, you just land wrong one time, it hurts. Morell. Don't play at the plate and uh, diving in safely is Vasquez. Velasquez as they record the second out at first. What another run up, four to two. Drove in six and he gets hit there. Bases are loaded for the Cubs with two outs. And that's going to do it. As they are juiced for Tyler Danish on in relief of Rich Hill. Missed it, and that'll walk in a run, and it's four to three. He 
checked, and that's going to be ball four. They did appeal first base umpire agreed it was a walk. So they are all loaded up for Jared Duran. Line drive, a leap, can't get it. In to score story here comes Vasquez. Throw to the plate, the tag, and he is out. On the peg at the plate. And a run does come in to score. Trevor Story in front of the throw to home, crossed home plate, so the Red Sox take a 5 3 lead here in the middle of the sixth inning. Morrell has struck out, grounded out, grounded out again, but he has an RBI today. Morrell gets a hold of one, back it goes, deep left, and gone. Third game in a row with a home run for Morrell. And the two run shot. Ties it up. Hap looking for some green grass and he'll find it. Contreras motoring towards third. He will hold there. Ian Hap's third hit of the game. And now they've got a pair in scoring position. It's basically. Yep. <laughs> and they will there to load them up once again for Ortega. And that'll get Cora. Bases are loaded. Two outs. And it's low and inside, it gets away, and the go-ahead run scores. A wild pitch, and the Cubs lead six to five. Wilson Contreras coming down the line from third, sliding in. There is David Robertson trying to shut this thing down for the Cubs with a one-run advantage into the ninth. Ref Snyder sends that one back to the track yeah. and at the base of the wall. Vasquez reels it in, one down. Hot shot to Higgins, stays down on it, two outs. First pitch swinging. Nico Horner is there. Cubs win.